But hey guys, welcome to another channel, welcome to another video, welcome to another banger, welcome to another YouTube video, whatever you should call it. So today, I'm going to give y'all a video about Girl Talk. So I'm going to give y'all that video right now, and we have a video about Girl Talk. So the first thing on the list is relationships. So the first thing is if you want to be with that person that you're with right now and you want to be with him and you want to be with him forever and you want to be in this relationship with him forever, stay with him and don't break up with him and don't cheat on him and everything else. That's what I tell y'all. And yeah, because if you don't like this person and you don't want to be in this relationship with this person, just don't break the person heart don't leave him and don't do this don't do that and da, 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 and don't don't break up with this person because i will not break up with this person i won't leave this person and this and that but if this person cheats on you and he could constantly if he constantly cheats on you and everything else I would, I would leave him for good. I would leave him and just like, like you cheated on me so many times. I feel like you just, we just need space. We need separation. I just need time from you because you keep cheating on me. So I would have done that. But yeah, that's all I can say about the relationship. Now, period. Let's talk about periods. But yeah, so periods. So if you have your period, just one thing is take your medicine, be prepared for it, get a pad, be prepared for it, take some medicine, get some ibuprofen, get some Tylenol, get some ibuprofen, get some water, get some ginger ale, get some, and then go outside and get some exercise. That's all I can tell y'all about periods. And if you can't take the little pains, Go get an ice pad or get a hidden pad or something like that for your periods and all of that because that's what I would have done is get a hidden pad and all of that and and everything else and get that over with and my pain will be done and you know, not just took some. But let's talk about fake friends. So I have this little friend of mine and I'm gonna say her name. Her name is Asia. And me and her was friends for like so long. I don't know how long we were friends, but we were friends for so long. And she, I was, I'm dating her ex, and she get mad at me. She get mad at me because I'm still talking to him, and I'm talking to Jordan too. But I don't care. This is my relationship. I'm with Nate and I'm with him and you not with him. And she's a fake friend. <laughs> and she's a fake friend. So that's like a fake friend one on one because she always trying to fight you and she always trying to have beef with you. That's a fake friend. And you don't need that person. You don't need nobody in your life like that. So I just got her out. I just got her out of my life. And me and her are not friends no more. We're not communicating with each other no more. If you have like a fake friend and that talks to your boyfriend and still blow his phones up, leave her. Like, leave that friend. Don't text that friend no more. And don't communicate with that friend no more. Don't even blow her phone up. No one say that y'all want to be friends. That's what I would have done. But, um, yeah, that's what I had to say because, like, who wouldn't, I'm going to say this, who wouldn't be, who wouldn't be my friend after so long, after we got out of school, we've been, me and her, me and that girl have been friends for so long since we got out of school, and you getting mad over one dude that don't want you. She don't know nothing about relationships. She don't know nothing about love. You're crazy and you delusional. And that's your ex. that is your ex. He's with me now. 
like go on with your day and go talk to and go talk to somebody else like go date somebody else it's like blowing up my boyfriend's phone every day stop blowing up his phone stop doing that but like that's talk that's a fake friend that's what i call a fake friend if a fake friend keep calling your boyfriend trying to talk to your boyfriend trying to steal trying to see him that's a fake friend but um and that break girl code like let's talk about girl code once you break girl code and you still try and talk to your best friend's nigga that that breaks girl code and that breaks my trust in our friendship like for real and you still talk to my man and you still communicate with my man my man do not want you like let me say this to y'all let me say this and i'm done like i'm, I'm almost done but girl talk let me give y'all some real advice if you have a friend that be so fake to you and then one day she texts you and be like can we be friends again and this and that just say no because you cannot be that girlfriend no more if she don't want to be your friend if you don't be friends with her but i don't want to be her i don't want to be like friends with her because she's fake and i don't want to be with nobody else but that's all i gotta say about that let me give you advice too more advice about periods too just don't be so cry and emotional because you when you're period you get emotional and you start crying and all of this stuff but it don't matter at this moment so and if you ever let me know if you ever have like a fake friend or having problems with your period and you have cramps all the time and you're going through it let me know and then if you have problems in relationship let me know down in the comment section down below but y'all gonna like comment and subscribe to my channel and turn on my post notification bell because if you don't turn on my post notification notification bell then what you doing but let me say this to my bottom of my heart don't ever be hanging out with fake friends don't even text your fake friends don't even acknowledge them don't even acknowledge the time they say that they want to fight you and they want to have they really want to talk they still talk to your boyfriend or talk to somebody do not acknowledge it because i would not acknowledge stuff like that so i'm gonna let y'all go i'm gonna go y'all so y'all gonna like this video and go subscribe to my channel and comment down some things that y'all want to know about the situation between me and asia and I could do a story time on that. I could do a video on that and everything else. But y'all go like, comment, subscribe, and turn your post notification bell. And I love y'all. We'll be with that giant peace. Hey guys, so today is my period day one. So period day one is the worst thing to go through. It's period day one. So I'm drinking this. I just took some Tylenol. So that probably gonna settle it for hours so i gotta wait eight hours i'm gonna show you what i took i took these these little ones that said eight hours so i gotta wait eight hours so yeah so let me eat my food let this ball this water ball and i'm making i'm making, making kool-aid but i'm eating my food and then i'll get back to y'all I'm gonna get back to y'all maybe later in the morning for day two of my period because it's day one. So let me take let me let me drink this ginger ale. Show y'all what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna drink this ginger ale. but yeah i'm gonna get back to y'all once i get done eating and all of that and get done fixing these so yeah
so yeah so like comment and subscribe to my channel get this video to three thousand likes and i love y'all one people love y'all one people and peace hey y'all i am back now i am this is my channel i'm still eating I don't like being on my period because it's painful and it's a struggle for the girls to go through and boys don't understand like y'all don't understand like girls go through pain they go through emotion and everything I go through my emotions and everything and I don't like that but I go through my emotions that's what I see y'all don't see me they look girl love Who wanna go do this honey? Who wanna go do this honey? I know this one of my people won't come home. I mean my friends start fucking with that. You're like, oh, you guys are yep. It started when I was sitting on that chair. And they looked in my room. And I mean I don't like it. Yeah, dude. I'm a girl. I don't do it. I'm saying. Let me know how. After it. Yeah, boys don't understand. Like when a girl is cramping, but you look at her emotions. That's okay. I'm correct. It's on her stuff. I'll get the ginger ale. Two cents. Frosty. I'll get ginger ale. But. Okay, I forgot to tell you all the car went out last night. So if y'all see all the little zeros on my plane, the car went out there. But it came on, back on that night. So. But, I'll hit one. Yeah. Yeah, I'm trying to use this little, but I'm still seeing it in the park a little. A little bit. But not a lot. But I'm still a little bit. I'm going to the door and let me know that I'm going to the I am. So, let me have some girl talk. Let me have some girl talk. But, you know, now, periods are the worst. But guess what? We're women. We're human. We go through this. We go to crap. And we go through emotions. All the time when we win our period. And me, I go do a lot when I talk around. I crack them back. I'm not cracking. I got used to it. I didn't crack. I'm looking at the drill. I just put my eyes open at 753. I'm not cracking. 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 i am and when, it, and when they stop. That's so, why, yeah. So, yeah, that's that. My girls didn't know. Yeah. You had your first period. And how you went, when you first disappeared, and when, how you went through it. Like, I maybe get her, I want to go do this again. But, but yeah, I don't want to use that beer out no more. I use that clue out. Now give me some oh, another out to use. Put that clue out. It would be wrong. Y'all let me know. I ain't gonna change down below. Girls, let me know. Some people that out. I can use. But yeah. Mm hmm. And then it's yeah. I can say it's beer. It's all the words. 
relationship. Yeah. That's the worst word. That if you're in a relationship, and if you're in a toxic relationship, then if you can't, if you love this person and you don't want to be in this toxic relationship no more, leave. Take all your stuff and leave. Because you don't want to be in a toxic relationship with somebody that is going to keep telling you what to do and tell you not what to not do and what to not wear. But I've been through that sometimes. I've been through that. My relationship that I was in a year ago, I was in that kind of relationship. Let me tell y'all about that. I was at a football game, and I was sitting down, and I was sitting beside him, and he was on his phone, and I saw a, he was texting another girl, and he was about to slap me and all that. And my cousin now showed up and everything and popped up, went out of nowhere, and then he started trying to fight him. But that's that. That's that. And woman, if you want to be, if you don't want to be in a relationship, leave. That's what I did. I love that. <clears throat> I love that toxic relationship, and and I'm glad I love because he was toxic. He was controlling and all that. And I don't need to be with someone that's toxic and that's controlled. I don't need to be with somebody like that.